indeed. Yes, indeed. Boom, baby, boom. Rise and shine. Even on a cloudy Sunday with a little bit of rain, we still out here. We still out here. Where you at? If you ain't ever doing it, your boy Marky Saints doing it. We're doing some Saints giving as we speak every third Sunday. Come on, Ty, get in it. She's been doing third Sundays for a hot minute. The shoes, the clothes, the toiletries, the music, the kush stock, the smile. Oh, and and she's giving away a swag bag. She got her own weed swag bags, and if you don't show up, you ain't gonna know where it's at. Thank you for the music. Thank you for the music. Yes, look at all these awesome volunteers getting it together. This is a blessing, you guys. Get your get your little bit of everything in each one. You know what I'm saying? Miss Rose is on it, bitch. She's so lovely. Look at her go. She got how many hot dogs going? How many hot dogs going? Yes, all the baked old ladies. Yes. And it's such a blessing to be here. I'm telling you. Your boy loves his life and look at this. You know, look, listen, let's get let's get into this. Hold up. Let me pull you in real quick. Let me pull you in real quick. I'm gonna tell you something. I love my city. I love Las Vegas. Las Vegas is built off the town, it's built off the backs of losers. Right now it's 222. It's a blessing to be alive. And for those that have ever had to be at the Seagull Suites, for those that have ever never had anywhere to stay but the park, for those that have ever had a tragedy befallen them in their life, this is for you. This is why we give back. You know, it's like easy to smile when all weekend long I went to conventions where people just splurged $50,000 and $20,000 on a booth and, and, and installing $14,000 sound systems on their boats and spending $25,000 to spend their boat to get towed to here. I asked myself, what is your give back? And that's why I ask people, what do you give back for having the blessings that you get? What do you give back when you get a have a city has billions of dollars of of right here actually it's right here billions of dollars of industry but right here the disparity and that's where you get saints addiction from right this is a dichotomy the balance between good and evil we all have it we've all been there down and out when we were carrying our own belongings by ourselves we've all been down and out where we didn't have any friends or mental stability we've all been there but yet we forget all we all is rushing to this i had this this, this, this is the morning marijuana motivation hold up let's get some blessings going get your roken vape got you if you need a mini tank holler at me smoking review we're gonna keep these are the weed swag bags too and all these blessings of business and people dealing with me i have always found a way hold up there's the stratosphere right there for me to give back for the blessings that i receive and the reason i'm saying this is morning marijuana motivation i had this thought of everyone desperately like crabs in a barrel rushing we were talking about the spotlight like it only shines on the first place if you're on fourth place or lower no one even noticed that you're on the on 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 the spot you weren't even noticed and when you're not noticed people stop caring right they only care if it has their own self-interest and what's interesting is their self-interest is to get out of this barrel so much so that they're willing to grab someone else down to get up i bought one of the few ty hamilton the few human beings that are actually reaching back down to help other crabs out. When's the last time you helped someone out? I hear it from people all the time telling me, and usually they're complainers, they're addicted to complaining, and they're telling me why they don't give back. You know what I mean? They're telling me why that person doesn't deserve it, and I'm busting my ass, and they're not doing anything, so why do I give them a leg up? And I thought to myself, there's gonna be a day you're gonna need that leg. There's going to be a day where you're not going to be all rainbows and butterflies. You're not going to be smiley, sunshiny. Instead, there's going to be no friends. Your boy Saint knows about this. This is where this whole business was built. When I had graduated college homeless, shout out to the UNLV shorts. Thank you. Graduated from college homeless and there was nobody. I had burnt bridges. I had had any friends and I needed it the most. 
That's why we call it Mostly Saints. It's when you need it the most. Because Saints Giving is an app to get you when you need it at that moment. There's going to be a moment when all you need is maybe $30. Or maybe all you need is $5. Or maybe it's not just money. Maybe all you need is someone to talk to. Maybe all you need is a ride. Maybe you just need a bus pass. There are so many things to get us out of these situations, yet we just ignore it. As long as it's not us. As long as I'm good, I'm not going to see other people. But your boy goes around the world and I see everyone. I see the third world countries. I see the poverty. I see the splendor. I see all that is glory over here on the strip shining with the wind right here. But there's also that dark side, that addiction side. People don't want to talk about their, they're burnt out. Maybe they have depression. Maybe they have mental imbalance. Maybe they ain't got no friends. And that's where we are human in the end. We're all human in the end. We're all breathing oxygen. We all need a leg up. We all need friends. We all need mental stability. And that's why I do the morning marijuana motivation every day. It's every day. It's that imperative. You don't have it. It's a trickle down effect. You don't have, it's more than just not having money. <laughs> you, know, you don't have these things, all those crabs at the top of the barrel trying to put the other ones down. Like we don't want you to have out and we know how bad it is down. But nobody wants to look down. They only want to look up. Who's in first place? Who has the spotlight? And I'm on some, put the spotlight on something awesome. Like us feeding the homeless out here. Getting stuff done for our community that gives us so much. If I get to be blessed to just walk down the street and go talk to billionaires and CEOs and opportunity, what's my give back? And that's why I keep asking people, what's your give back? What do you do for your blessing? How do you think your lifestyle how do you congratulate like i was telling my friends almost says such a weird thinking but this is the morning marijuana motivation it gets deep like am i going to sacrifice my goat in front of the statue of zeus to get favor is that what we're going to do we're just going to uh just beg for favor no 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 how about we earn favor how about we earn it from our universe and the vibe that we give and the energy that we give as long as you're giving energy, energy is going to be coming to you. This is a fact of, uh, what's the one, what they call it? The, um, help me out, help me out when you're physics. And everybody knows about energy. We all know about vibe. We all know about attitude. But how many of us actually do something about it? How many of us are going to do something with our attitude and our knowledge and our love to transpire a different outcome? Because the way I see it is I'm still helping me, if you want to be selfish. I'm still helping me because I'm the guy in the line. I was here, dude. I was here when the shit went down. I was here when I had no friends and I needed a meal and I just needed a hand or someone to talk to. That's what Thanksgiving's all about. So I'm going to let you go. I'm going to let you guys all be free. Don't forget on your heart from the start, your morning marijuana motivation time is Saints Addiction. This is how we do it. And if you can give of any of the following, please come to the park, Cambridge, Cambridge and Katie. You can see the sign, Cambridge and Katie, Seagull Suites. We're putting the meals together. Hamilton's first time feeding. We got the hot dogs going. We got people chilling in the streets. We, we're gonna do our rounds and invite people, chips school everything see people are starting to come in so let's get in here and let's let them get yeah please yeah and then everything else is just clothing so you got extra clothes toiletry love see you out in Malaskis. your boy marky saint saint's addiction on my heart from the start this is saint's giving and i love my life ah, i love my life how many other people can say that See you on the other side.